Hello and welcome back to CAD Chaos. I'm your host, Michael Smith, and today I'm going to be going over the aligned section view, which happens to be one thing that needs a specific sequence to truly work correctly. So I'm going to be showing you the sequence I use to do it successfully. So in this case, when you have a weird profile sketch and you want to show the absolute height of this V groove that goes along the entire thing, I don't know, for whatever reason, you need a section, a line section view, which I don't end up using that often. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to start off by actually selecting the window I want. And now I'm going to come over and I'm going to make a sketch. So that's real simple. I just double click on the window and then right click and move my mouse to the left. That gives me my line command here. And now I'm going to start off where I want this to begin. And I'm just going to make a series of lines that I will then just connect. Okay, so I'm going to start my sketch off the part, and I'm just going to drag down to where I actually want all the jog points to be. In this case, I've given myself a really easy profile to follow, just for the sake of making this video a little quicker. So there you go, I've created a sketch, and it is in where I would like the section view to appear. So now that I have that, I'm going to right click on that sketch, and I'm going to say select chain. Now I do have a whole nother video of this on my channel if you want to check it out, selecting other objects and lines and hidden stuff. So select chain, that's going to select the entire lines that I just put down. And now I'm going to come over here without doing any other things, and I'm going to click aligned section view. That's going to follow those lines that I just created and give you a section view that in Indeed, is a little bit different than what you would have if it were just a straight line. So there you go. That is how to use the Align Section tool in SolidWorks on the detailing end of things, which is kind of a new direction for what we're doing here at CAD Chaos. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out if you share with your friends as well. Have a great day.